Um, all right, everyone. Um, I am Adumala from Nigeria. So I'll be showing you how to. Uh, I'll show you how to do an iOS on on an upgrade on Cisco 95 on the switch. So firstly, I am consoled um, into my device. So let me do show IP interface brief. Okay, I have some IP assigned already, but nothing has been assigned on my gigabit internet zero slash zero, which is my management interface. So I will do config terminal and um, interface G zero slash zero. I'm gonna give it an IP, which is a uh, IP address one seven two dot oops oops one nine two dot one six eight dot fifty dot one two five five dot two five five dot two five five dot zero no shots the I'm gonna exit from this let me do no login console I can see every console logs. Then after that, I can do to cross check if the IP is there. So I'll do show run interface um, G0 slash 0. Okay, I can see this already. So then my TFTP on my TFTP server, uh, I'm using SolarWinds TFTP server uh, on the file and the configure. I have already I have already set my I have uh 192.1.50.2 yeah so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try if I can ping 50.1 from my local IP from my local PC rather can I ping it say request timeout okay yes it's responding now to confirm again it's responding beautiful then let me ping from the switch uh, from the switch let me do let me go back to the privilege mode so I will do ping VRF because I'm pinging from the management VRF uh, VRF management IP I'm pinging my local PC which is serving as my TFTP server 192.168.50. Um, oh beautiful it's responding so I uh, I want to upgrade from let me do show version our current version on this switch is uh, Cisco IIS XC software version 16.6.4 which is uh, Everest so we are moving to 16.9.1 and the reason why I'm doing an upgrade is because I actually want to stack the two switches using stack wise virtual so let me start right now so i have my command here already so i will take i'll copy this command and paste directly so if i do this it should communicate to my tftp server you can see there's a communication going on already on my tftp server from the switch so i'm going to pause the video and resume back when it is done hello so um you can see that it has finished adding the package so the package added was um ios xe 16.9.1 that's fuji so the next step is going to be to do install activate so i'm going to come so I'm going to do install, you're going to run install, um, activate, then you press enter. So it's going to ask you a question, you're going to do yes. So I'm going to do yes, press Y. So you can see that it is activating the package. 
this is gonna take about a few minutes maybe three minutes okay good it is done so it's asking me that this compression requires a reload of the system do i want to proceed of course i want to produce so i'm, I'm gonna type yes again why then it's activating all the members then in the in the process of activating this switch is going to reload itself it's going to do a reload by itself and during that i am actually going to lose a connection to my tft server but that is not a problem since we are already done with the tftp so let's wait for i guess a few minutes then it should be done oh beautiful so you can see from this it says finish activating you can see it has removed the old file my old file was uh the old file was 16.6.4 you can see now that we now have 16.9 as a new file so the switch is reloading at the moment So we are waiting for the switch to come up and once once it has finished reloading Vala we have uh sixteen point nine point one. So you can see that okay. I think I will have to pause the video and when it is done I will come back. Alright, so um you can see that the switch has finally restarted so the last thing we actually going to do to commit our configuration we're going to use the command install commit and after that then we should be in our new oh voila success so we're going to let me do a show version to confirm if oh beautiful you can see that we are now in version 16.9.1 which is fuji so next uh, let me see if i can run my command that i want to do which is stack why so i can do cisco stack uh, uh sorry stack wise virtual beautiful so this is the command i wanted to run to stack my cisco 9500 switches but i don't have this command on the uh, Everest software which is Cisco iOS 16.6.4 so thank you for watching I hope this is informative for you um, thank you